Hello everybody, it's Claire from Claire Path Guidance and Tarot coming to you for your monthly reading, love reading, uh, for March for the sign of Scorpio. So I've been just, in all the videos this month, I'm just kind of talking about myself, um, that I've been, I'm an empath, I've been doing this for five years, started, started up my channel in October and um, have been doing readings and I am very good at this. I'm just kind of telling you guys, these are general readings. So it's not meant for all of you Scorpios out there. If you're looking for a reading, specific reading, I am the person for you. Um, I know what I'm doing. I can tap into anybody. I have done so many readings now where people are like, you are spot on. I cannot believe how you got that guy's personality or that girl's personality or um, everything that I say um, I have... Um, been able to back it up with the tarot cards as well. Um, I charge $40 for a reading. I don't do live readings only because it's hard to line up the times. We don't we don't all live in the same time zone. So it's really hard for me to line up a live, live reading when you live in Europe or Asia or Philippines or something like that. It's really, really tough. So you just email me your questions. I do the reading video it, send it to you, you click on the link, watch the video. If you have more questions, go ahead and answer, ask them, I don't mind. I have a lot of people that I've done readings for and weeks later they'll email me, can you pull me a card, can you tell me how things are going, this is what's going on. You buy a reading from me and it's kind of like ongoing coaching, I don't care. It's not going to um, uh, affect me in any way pulling a card or helping you out for two, three minutes. Sometimes it, you know, and sometimes it, it'll take a day or for me to, or two for me to get back to you about it. But for the most part, I'm I'm emailing you back right away. I've even when I first started up this channel in October, um, I gave out one free question to everybody, and there are people who have never purchased a reading from me, and they are still emailing me and asking me questions. I have no issues with that. I'm not that kind of a person that's going to say, give me $40 and I will help you. I'm here to help. So um, anyway, so okay, so onto the reading for the Scorpios out there. Um, the very first card I, pu I pulled here is give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. So if you're feeling like it, you're stuck, something's, you know, not right, give your relationship a chance. It's worth it. All right. Um, uh, I'm just going to see what the book here says. Give your relationship a chance. The romance angels see that your relationship is worth devoting effort to. Although there may be issues, these can be worked through and healed. You'll never, sorry, you'll need to commit to the relationship to ensure the best chance of success. At the very least, if you do end it, you'll know that you gave it your all. You'll also understand the role that you played in its dynamics. In this way, You'll avoid attracting similarity pain, similarly painful situations in the future. You receive this card because there's hope for your partnership. The love, instilled, the love is still there. Working with a counselor may be your best option at this point. This professional can identify areas of dysfunction and guide you both in healthier directions. So, you know what? You, have a, you hit a bump in the road, it's telling you. Give it a chance. Don't give up. Look at the guns on that guy. <laughs> I give him a couple of chances. I think every time this card comes up, that's exactly what I say all the time. I give him a chance or two, you know. <laughs> Look how pretty he is. <laughs> all right, so the second card here is finance and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. So that might be putting some pressure on your relationship as well. All right. Are you working too hard or you're ne neglecting your family um, or your spouse? All right. This card is coming up telling you that you need to take a step back and start paying attention to your love life. It, um, it's it's um, there's something going on because this one here too. Right. Give your relationship a chance. This if this finance card is um, it's probably causing trouble. That's probably where the root of it is, is you're working too hard. Maybe you work away from home and um, it's causing trouble. So stop and reevaluate. All right. And the last card here is worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. So start working on it. It's worth waiting for. This person is worth it. Um, 
worth waiting for. Let's see here. Your soulmate relationship requires patience as there are many factors involved. Your soulmate's free will choices are beyond your you or the angel's control, as in the readiness of both of you for true love. This card comes to you as a reminder that this relationship is worth waiting for. Divine timing is a universal law that is always in operation. It is a flow of everything. If we try to impose our human will and force things to happen, we become out of sync with nature and experience blockages. Similarly, if we fret, when will I meet my soulmate, we put worry energy out into the universe. The romance angels have heard and answered your prayers for a soulmate and they are working behind the scenes to bring this to you. Your role, your role is to listen to and follow your intuition. So it's telling you here it's worth it's worth it. So, you know, you've got this card here where it says give your relationship a chance, work on it. It's worth it. You might not have what you want right now. There's a lot of things affecting in fact uh affecting this finances and career but if you hang in there and work on it it's worth waiting for that this relationship will give you everything that you want and desire emotionally physically all of that all right okay Scorpios I hope you have a wonderful um, uh, March if you would like a private reading I would be more than happy to give you one my email address is at the bottom of this video in the text um, area. And uh, go ahead and drop me a line if you're looking for a private reading. All right. Thank you for viewing my video.